What is up, Bray Gang? Dobro Doshli. All my Balkan peoples and everybody else watching. It's your boy back at it again with another banger. Now, I did tell you guys I had a big body banger for you guys today. And that's the case. That is true. Um, I told you guys I would be making a top 10 Balkan songs I'm listening to in 2020. Now, um, obviously, if the song, if, the, if you know a song that you're listening to doesn't make it on this list, it doesn't mean that I'm not listening to it. This is just this just means that this is what I'm currently listening to, pretty much regularly. You know, um, don't know why. I just figured I would share you my playlist. I did it with a lot of my German songs and stuff like that. And I'm like, hey, I have a pretty big Balkan following as well. Might as well do it with that as well. Um, if you want me to do a part two, a part two to this where I have um, a lot more songs um, and stuff that I'm listening to from the Balkan area because i listen to a lot of music trust me a lot of music get this video to 1000 likes i did the same thing for my german uh playlist and stuff 1000 likes and i'll make a part two and i'll have an updated play playlist of all the people i'm listening to from the balkans and stuff i even do a top 10 but these are the top 10 songs i'm listening to in 2020 and we're gonna start from the top uh, if you guys are new to the channel welcome if you're a returning viewer welcome back we post videos every single day and they're kind of random I mean they're international based and stuff so I mean you can kind of get a feel for what we're doing based off of that but the very first song um, that I wanted to start off with all right the very first song I want to start off with for number 10 is uh, Adidas Slobo do Merani. I don't know why I listen to it a lot, but I do. So this it is. Hey, hey! One of my favorite songs. I've been listening to it on repeat when I'm driving to work, when I'm cleaning up in the house, when I'm just vibing and drawing, which I need to work on my animated story time. I have another one that I'm in the works of creating right now. Anyways, um, very good song. I love it. The music video, the visuals are on point. You know what I'm saying? She beautiful, beautiful. You feel me? But um, definitely wanted to, to you know, kind of mention that because this is a song that, like I said, I could, I could definitely vibe to. Love the vibes. I love, love, love the vibes. Love the music. Love her voice. Uh, like I said, the video was absolutely amazing. And that's what I listened to. I mean, that's that's number 10. That's number 10. So I know a lot of you guys are like, oh my God, James. Oh my God. No, I mean, that, it's a good song. It's a very good song. Uh, and on top of that too, um, this list is going to have a mixture of songs, like, you know, singing songs and rap songs kind of blended together. Because I listen to a lot, a lot of different st type, type of stuff. So um, trust me. I listen to hundreds of different uh, Balkan songs, but like I said, this is my top 10. If you want me to make another, like a part two to this, I need y'all to get this video to a thousand likes. Anyways, the next song that we're going to be checking out um, that is on my top 10 list that places at number nine is a whopping uh, <laughs> Real Slavs by Kukush and Don Playa. Um, this is what it sounds like. Real Slavs. We just having fun, but when it's trouble time, ah. we don't joke around. Yo, so, this song goes dummy hard. I, I literally listened to this uh, last year for the first time ever, and I absolutely fell in love with the song. It was insane. It was amazing. It comedy, 100% comedy, dude. I was laughing. I enjoyed it. The song went crazy. I could turn up to this anytime, literally anytime. And um, I'm pretty sure a lot of people will agree with me when I say it's a very, 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 very good song. Very good song. Very hype. Very hype. I know it's an older song that was made a while back. But like I said, this is just stuff I'm listening to currently. Currently. Like this year. Okay. Now, moving down the list, we already covered number nine. Now we're moseying on down to number eight. Okay. Number eight for me, I don't know why I listen to this a lot. I'll explain it in detail, but it's DeVito's Oh Dude Z. Now I'm not sure if I said that right, Oduzet, but <laughs> literally loved it. I love this song for the hook. The hook was amazing, man. When I let my Oduzet, I'm like, oh my god, oh my god. Literally, this song always pokes the soft spot in my brain, and I'm like, ooh, <laughs> it's so good, man. It's so good. DeVito killed it, bro. He did a good job. I'm a huge, huge, huge fan, man. A huge fan of his music. And um, 
does a very good job uh, when it comes to just dropping big body bangers, man. He does a very good job. So um, I, I I always listen to this, especially if I'm like working out. I don't know why I, I put this in my workout playlist, but it's a part of my workout playlist. I listen to it a lot. And, um, you know, just once again, when I'm chilling, just vibing, doing random stuff around the house or just driving to work or whatever. This is this is literally what I have on a lot. I cycle through this and a bunch of other songs. And speaking of other songs, why don't we move on to a whopping number six? Seven. Number seven is pretty interesting. I know you guys are gonna be scratching your head and going like, what? <laughs> oh my God. But you shouldn't be scratching your head because your boy is, um, I have a, I have a celebrity crush, all right? I'm guilty. I have a lot of celebrity crushes, but this particular celebrity crush is uh, very talented, uh, a very talented singer that goes by the name Seta Yo, obviously. And uh, <clears throat> the name of the song is Nimam Vrema Wait, name on Remena Zato. Let me just play it. So let's listen. The reason why I like this song so much is because it's a big body banger. I mean, straight up, come on, man. Like, she can sing and she can rap. When, when I found that there was a song where she was singing and like borderline rapping a little bit, I'm like, oh! I did not, I did not even know that. Okay, I did not even know she could do both of them things. I know she could sing, but I didn't know she was dropping like big body bangers like that, okay? Speaking of big body bangers, we're gonna segue ourselves all and over to number six. Now, I'm not sure if I'm doing this um, the right way, but the, the, the here, here's, here's what I will say. I immediately got hooked. The hook for me, like, absorbed me into this song. I mean, Balkans has a bunch of bangers that I feel like are underrated. I mean, I want the world to hear this. And I was just like, damn! And what is this song? So I can quit beating around the damn bush. It's by Teodora, and it's called Tracy, 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 Tracy. Tris, 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 tris. I know um, for me, I, I listen to it a lot, even recently, because I'm just like, dang, like, <laughs> it goes hard. It's just the hook. It's like, I'm like, oh my God. Oh my God. And the video, have you guys seen the video? I think one of the, the most motivating factors for this whole song is like, I remember the video. Whew, lots of eye candy in that video, so I'm gonna say. Anyways, so I don't sound entirely thirsty. We're gonna move on to number five. Number five is pretty interesting for me because I know a lot of you guys recommended this particular artist to your boy, and I know this is a classic, and I had to, you know, play this a lot. I still play it a lot now, and it's by Smoke Mariano. Ya repuya. Honestly, I get strong old school vibes from Smoke Mariano, and he's super, super cool. Super, super cool. Uh, makes very high quality music. Lyrics, bars are on point. If you translate them, I have translated his lyrics and bars before. And absolute genius. Absolute genius. And completely, completely uh, mad respect to the dude. Because, I mean, he makes big body bangers. And speaking of big body bangers again, we're moving on down to number four. Okay, number four. Number four for me. Uh, is another song I still can't get out of my head to this day. I still can't get out of my head, man. The second I listened to it, I'm like, I instantly fell in love. I think this is my introduction to this artist, actually. Very first song I've ever listened to. I feel like I this is the very first song I ever listened to. No, 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 my bad. I take that back. I listened to another song before, prior to this. But this is the first song I 100% fell in love with when I first listened to. And it's a song. It's not really a rap song. But um, it's by, once again, Seta Yo, a.k.a. Bay Across the Way. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, but it's called Millie Millie, and you guys know how I feel about this, man. I've played it a lot. Love it! I love it, man. You know why I love this song so much? Because this is a strong reflection of the early 2000s. I'm a 90s baby, dude. I'm a fucking 90s baby. So when I hear stuff like this, of course, it's going to press the nostalgia button in my head. I love the song. One of my favorite songs of all time across, like, across music from America, across music from 
so wild though. I literally, when I when I think of like my top favorite songs of all time, Millie Millie's up there. Speaking of missing good music, we're moving on over to number three, which is amazing. Okay, it's absolutely stunning. If you guys haven't heard it, you gotta listen to it. It's a it's a big body banger. Honestly, you know me, the BBBs. You know what I'm saying big body bangers are, are are very prominent on this channel. If you want a good re music recommendations, listen to your boy, cause I got good taste. Contrary to poppy believe, your boy's got great taste. Okay, okay. Anyways, um. Gazda Paya, Prince Belvedere is number three for me on my list of songs I'm listening to a lot. Uh, don't know why, but it is a big body banger. Like I listen to this all the time, all the all the time. I'll be Chris, Prince Belvedere, Prince Belvedere. Speaking of Prince Belvedere. <laughs> Segway it on over to number two. All right, number two for me hits a very, 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 very soft spot in my chest, all right? I am obsessed, obsessed with this song. When I say I'm obsessed, I listen to this song, no kidding, at least 10 times a day. Throughout the day, 10 times a day. The song is, is what? three minutes so that's 30 minutes of my day every single day listening to this particular song now what is this song you might ask God, what is he listening to this damn much every day huh what's it what is it he listening to this much every day well since you must ask let me play you a masterpiece by mike mc called duh it's just me it goes crazy because it's like he can sing and he can rap so it goes together he has a lot of good songs trust me he has a lot of good songs and like i said if you get this video to a thousand likes i will show you the bigger list of songs i'm listening to like i said these are the top 10 songs i'm listening to currently doesn't mean these are my top favorite of all time i have a top favorite balkan songs of all time and if you want me to drop that video get this video to 2000 2000 likes and i will show top 10 balkan songs of all time this is just the top 10 balkan songs i'm listening to in 2020 all right i, I, I that's what i'm saying now number one gonna be controversial but come on man it's 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 the one the only the song that i think put croatia on the map for me honestly i was like dang all right croatia got some got some bangers out here all right i didn't know these guys are croatian like okay cool yeah i know where i'm going with this right <laughs> you know what i'm about to say hey hey comment down below what you think the song is that i'm about to say if you think if you know if you know if you think you know all right, you ready? All right, it's by Kukush and Fox. It's called Ocha Kudas. Oh man, that's number one for me. That is all my top 10 Balkan songs I'm listening to right now. I listen to way more than 10 Balkan songs. Kia Kotsker is on the list. Um, Tia Dora is on the list. I think I've already mentioned Tia Dora though in this, but um, I, I listen to a lot of people, man. DeVito, there's a lot of songs from DeVito I listen to. God's the Pie I listen to. Uh, Thisafu I listen to. Uh, Surreal. Um, who else? I listen to a lot, lot. I'm telling you guys, a lot of people. Uh, Tiana. Um, I haven't. I, I, I think there's a song I need to check out, but I heard that her music's really good. But I'm telling you guys, there's so many people. There's people that I haven't even mentioned from Macedonia that I listen to. Tosco. Uh, there is uh, Tubona. Like, literally, there's a whole lot of artists that I haven't even mentioned yet. But if you want me to mention all of my favorite Balkan songs, the next 10 that I listen to regularly because i listen to a lot you need to get this video to 1000 likes 1000 likes okay i know we can do it okay i know we can do it now i know a lot of you guys might not agree with the list a lot of you guys might agree with the list but let me know what you think what are your top 10 favorite songs i want you to let me know 
top 10 favorite songs in the Balkan. So please give me your list in the comments down below so I can see if that lines up with my list of all time favorite Balkan songs. I'm curious because I'm just saying, your boy got introduced to the Balkan scene, you know, a little more than a year ago, right? And and I've, I've loved it ever since, loved it. I can't stop listening to it. You guys make amazing music. I wanna let you guys know I love you. I never forgot about you. I wanted to make this video dedicated to all my Balkan peoples because you guys are lit, okay? I needed to just drop this big body banger on you guys real quick. I'm gonna edit this real quick and then put put it up as a premiere for later. If you guys decide to watch it, cool. If not, you know what I'm saying? It, it is what it is, you know? I, I know you guys probably, you know, you probably hate me because I've been gone for too long, but I'm, I'm here. Trust me, I'm here. I got. I think today might just be an exclusive Balkan day only. I might drop an extra video about something else, but you know, I, I never forgot about you guys and I get that all the time. Like, oh my God, did you forget about your Balkan people? Oh my God. If you've noticed, I actually have been uploading a little bit more Balkan reactions and stuff again. So, uh, you know, uh, shout out to you guys. You guys are absolutely amazing. I love you guys so much. All of you, everybody from all over Zoaldo. Seriously, you guys are amazing. And if you want me to drop another video like this, like I said, get this video to 1000 likes. You feel me to drop my top 10 of all time? 2000 likes, all right? Um, and um that's pretty much it i'm gonna see y'all later thank you for watching take care bish uh i was gonna say bish bader loy to choose but I'm, I'm learning german but i don't know how to say see you later how do you say see you later in serbian i'll say i mean serbian macedonian um croatian um i know this will be different in either in every 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 language but let's just say serbian for now how do you say see you later in serbian because i don't know how to say that but how, whatever that is see you later i love you guys peace <laughs> Hey, what's up? Did you guys subscribe to the channel? Did you subscribe to the channel? Ah, well, if you haven't, make sure you do that. Also, we do have a Discord. The Discord link is always gonna be in the description down below on any of my videos, and it's dope. What we do on Discord is pretty simple. A lot of you guys are, I'm collecting you guys from a bunch of different countries, a bunch of different places, and you guys wanna teach me a whole bunch of stuff. You guys can join the Discord and teach me anything. You can send me any kind of messages and stuff. You can actually post memes. You can participate in the community and just make friends. Just Go ahead and join the Discord and see what, how, what what kind of situation you're getting into for yourself. Also, there's gonna be some giveaways in the future. There's gonna be some giveaways, but to create some incentive for that, I need you guys to follow me on Instagram. Are you guys following me on Instagram? You know what my Instagram looks like? You probably don't know what my Instagram name is. <laughs> it's right there. Just go ahead and check it out. Check it out. Check it out. It, it's dope. Uh, just follow me on Instagram. I, I do live streams every day. I try to, you know, engage with you guys in every way possible. I know a lot of, a lot, not a lot of creators are very engaging with their fan base. I try to be engaging. So just go ahead and check it out. There's no, no harm, no foul. Follow me on Twitter too. I honestly am trying to grow my Twitter, <laughs> but I don't really post that often on there. But when I do, you guys will be the first to see whatever post those will be. You know? I'm saying now if you guys want shout outs or whatever I don't know a lot of we have a lot of upcoming independent artists that have been hitting me up as of late I might create a series where I get I favor my international independent artists and stuff and I might promote you guys for free but just it might just be one or two a week you know I mean, you guys can give me some feedback on that but all to say follow me on my social medias all right if you guys aren't doing that already you need to do that because that's a pretty big deal <laughs> I'll see you guys later but enjoy the content I create it's gonna be random uh, reaction videos a lot of a lot of everything reaction videos vlogs challenges cooking videos gaming videos anything you guys suggest when you join my discord or message me on instagram but i'll see you guys soon take care follow me peace